Welcome to Real VR Fishing. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to level up quickly in the game by using the expert mode. Before we get started, take a minute to click the S in the corner to subscribe. I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers, so that'd be much appreciated. Also like, share, leave a comment if you have any tips or tricks on leveling up or making cash in the game, something I could be doing better. Just leave a comment. All that good stuff is appreciated. Let's get to it. So the first thing you want to do to uh, start earning more experience is turn on the expert mode of the game. And you can do that by going into the settings and change the difficulty to expert. Next thing you want to do is make sure if you can afford it and it's unlocked, you switch your lure to attract large fish. Medium large is fine too. I mean, the larger the better. You can get the, uh, you know, rare fish that are small, but, um, you know, shoot for the large, I would say, if you want to level up uh, faster. So once you've got those two things toggled, then just choose your favorite fishing spot and head on out. So the way that expert mode works is you're not going to get all of the indicators that you're used to. Um, you're just going to get a color on the line that's going to indicate what's happening with the fish. So basically when the line is white, you've got a, a good tension on the line. When the line is blue, there's not enough tension, you've got to reel in. When the line is red, there's too much tension, you've got to let the fish run. When the line is green, it means the fish is dazed or relaxed, so you can reel in like crazy there to get them in quick. So there's also no fish indicators, so, you know, cast uh, wherever you want to cast and just wait for tugs on the line. When the line's red, you basically you just let go of the reel. You don't have to reel at all. Don't hold on to it. Let it spin. That way the fish can uh, take as much tension off as it wants. I think we hit a, a dry spot here, not getting anything. You'll feel little vibrations, little tugs on the uh, on the rod if you're getting uh, some interest in your lure. But this seems like a dry spot. So let's give it another cast. That's looking a bit better. So there's some interest. We haven't got anything on yet. So now the fish is running. It's red. We can reel in because it's white. It went red. We want to let go. Let the fish run. It's white. I think, I think the fish is still on. Maybe not though. We got some tension. Yeah, fish is still on. So white means we can reel like normal. See red, let go. White, reel in. You can kind of move your rod the opposite direction of the fish if you want to tire it out. Red, let it go. Saw a little bit of blue there, so you want to reel in when it's blue. Red, let go. Blue, reel in. Get it back to white. Red, let off. White, just keep reeling steady. Red, let it off. White, we're reeling in. Red, let go. White. Red, let go. Blue, reel in a little harder, a little faster. Red, let go. So, kind of on the edge of red there. That's fine. Just, just let go completely when it hits the red. After a jump, you're usually going to get some blue, so you want to reel in. You know, try not to anticipate it. There are times where you get red after a jump too, but things to keep in mind. There's red let off. I'm just letting go completely when I see any red on the line. And then just grab it right back up when it's in the white.
same thing just keep it going nice and steady see that orange or red just let off let the fish do its thing and then green means pull her in so expert mode you're either going to get more credits if you choose to keep the credits or you're going to get more experience for the same fish caught if you are on easy mode and it's not really any more difficult than uh, than easy mode so i highly encourage you to uh, turn on expert give it a go I believe there's also a setting where you can turn off the color on the line, but, uh, you know, that would be Expert Plus or something like that. Definitely not going to be as easy, but that uh, would help with your immersion if you're into that. If you haven't already, take a minute to click the S in the corner to subscribe. Trying to get to a thousand subscribers, that'd be appreciated. This is Real VR Fishing. We're playing on an Oculus Quest 2 through Virtual Reality Desktop. We're playing the Rift version. Thanks for watching. And we'll catch you next time.